is the bomb in there. Get out. <laughs> deep fake, deep fake, deep fake. Gotta be kidding. This is a deep fake too. I'm not Adele, but I am an expert in online manipulation. Now tell me which video here is real. The answer is none of them. None of these is actually real. There are deepfake videos. Deepfakes have started to appear everywhere. Maybe you've seen a lot of deepfake videos on the internet. So, what is deepfake? Deepfake is a word that combines the terms deep learning and fake. The term deepfake is taken from a Reddit user. This deepfake phenomenon is growing rapidly online. But it doesn't stop there. What is it they've sent us? Help. It's already used many times, like Hollywood. So what? Who cares, right? It's just a movie. However, deepfake is a dark side. It can manipulate someone's face in a video to make it look like they're saying something that they originally didn't. Here are some examples. We're entering an era in which our enemies can make it look like anyone is saying anything at any point in time, even if they would never say those things. So, President Trump is a total and complete dipshit. That's not a real person. Even deepfakes can clone and generate human voices like this. We are actively working with the U.S. government on its ongoing investigations into Russian interference. According to Deep Trace Lab study, 96% of deepfake videos are pornographic. That's why many people have considered deepfake videos as dangerous and not something just created for fun. To fight the spread of deepfake videos and misinformation, Facebook, Amazon, Microsoft, and others are coming together to build a deepfake detection challenge. However, people who are skeptical with this regulation say that the concern of defects is too overblown. Despite the many concerns defects has brought in the past couple of years, the technology still has a great potential in the entertainment industry. Even if you ban defects videos on social media, eventually the effects will be as good as the real thing and become undetectable. So what do you think about deepfakes? And how do you feel? Honestly, I have mixed feelings about it because in this day and age of deepfakes, singing is not believing anymore. So that's it for this week's video and I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to click on the subscribe button and thanks again, I will see you next time.